Hello, everyone. Good evening. Hi, teacher. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Okay, let's wait one minute for uh, the rest of the class. Okay. Microphone, please. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and get started. Okay, today is class number seven. Okay, uh, welcome. Okay, uh, if you're here, say present. Ada Susena. Present teacher. Ana Maria Chacon. Ana Maria Chacon. Hey. Carla Ivania. Present. Carlos Armando. Carlos Armando Duarte. Okay. Uh, Claudia Maricela. I'm here, the, I'm here teacher. Okay. Present. Thank you. Okay. Deborah Raquel. Present. Elvin Martinez. Present. Fatima Lopez. Fatima Lopez. Fernando Ernesto. Present. Jose Antonio Cubías. Present. Jose Saúl González. Jose Saúl. Okay. Carla Jeanette Maya. Present teacher. Luis Sumaña. Luis Umaña, Miguel Ángel Paz, present. Miriam Carolina, present. Okay, thank you. René Alfonso, present. Rina Álvarez, no. uh, Sabrina Latín, present. Sandra Lese Berosorto, present. William Alexander Ramirez. Present. Okay, and then uh, Isela Liliana. Present. Okay. Karina Beatriz Santos. Karina Beatriz. Uh, Jocelyn Rivas. Present. Okay, very, very good, okay. A uh, personas que no, no han contestado todavía, tal vez se acaban de incorporar. Ana María Chacón. Okay. Uh, Carlos Armando Duarte. Uh, hold on. Carlos Armando Duarte. Okay. Uh, Fátima López. José Saúl González. Okay, Luis Umaña. Okay, uh, otra persona, Rina Álvarez. Okay, and uh, Solomon. Okay, and Karina Beatriz. I'm here. Okay, present. Okay, very good. Questions? 
¿Alguien que no llamé? ¿Alguien que no escuchó su nombre? ¿Que se acaba de incorporar? Ok. Me. Uh, who's me? What's your name? José Saúl González. Okay. okay. Thank you. All right, thank you. All right. Okay, guys, let's go ahead and continue. All right, so let's do uh, a review for today, okay? All right, so se acuerdan the difference between said and told, okay? Right, well, we are talking about another person, okay? For example, uh, Jose said that he checks emails, okay? Very good. Can I use told? ¿Cómo usaría told? Jose told me. Told me. He checks his told me. emails. That he Correct. Checks his Correct. Correct. All right. Very good. Okay. All right. One more time. Uh, one, one more example. Okay. The boss told me, uh, told the employees. I'm going to change it. The boss told the employees uh, to be on time. The boss told the employees to be on time. The boss said to be on time. Okay. Questions? Questions? Okay. All right. Very good. So, hicieron alguna de las hojas que les mandé? All right. Les mandé algunos uh, ejercicios extra. Okay. All right. Let's complete this, this one real quick just to review. Julie blank that she would join us after work. Julie? Yeah. Told me or said? Said. Said, yeah. very good. Mm -hmm. Number two, she blank me that she was going running this evening. Told me. Told. Okay. Very good. Number three, John blank us that he couldn't come to the party. Told oh. us. Told us. Mm -hmm. Told us. Number four, John blank that he had been in the cinema at the weekend. Said. Said. Number five, she blank them she wanted to quit. Told. Number six, David blank he was going to arrive at eight. David said. Said. Okay, said. Number uh, seven, they blank that they didn't want to meet us on Tuesday. Said. Yeah. It's said. Mm -hmm. Correct. Number eight, I blank him. I wasn't impressed. Told. Told him I wasn't impressed. And number nine, Lucy. Said yeah. Julie or told Julie? Told. Told Julie. Okay. Very good. Excellent. All right. Very good. Un repaso. ¿Hay, hay alguna pregunta con eso? All right. So lo voy a usar para reportar lo que uh, otra persona me dijo. ¿sí? Okay. Very good. So today we're going to go ahead and look at uh, the following. Okay. We're going to be able to ask and tell information about marketing strategies. All right. Aquí está la conversación que hicimos ayer. Uh, for example, this kitchen looks great. It does. Who is in charge of cleaning it? Jessica is. She cleans the kitchen from Monday to Wednesdays. She does a really good job. Indeed. But doesn't Jessica take orders during the morning shift? No, she doesn't. George does. He takes orders from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. I get it. And who does, after, who does after him? Does his brother take the orders after him? Yes, he does. Okay, it's a conversation, right? So you can use this to describe what you do, okay? For example, what do you do at work? Okay, a question, what do you do at work, okay? So you can use from to, for example, I. Uh, plan my classes 
from 10 a.m. to uh, 12 p.m. Do you see? I am using from to, and I am describing my activities. ¿Qué hago de, de esta hora a esta hora? ¿sí? I plan my classes from 10 a.m. to 12 p.m. Okay. I can also use different time expressions. I check emails in the morning. I check emails in the morning. Okay. Very good. Questions? Okay. Very good. So, I, for example, tell me in the chat, what do you do? From what hour to what hour? What do you do in the mornings? What do you do in the afternoons? Okay. You can use from to. Okay. Here in the chat. Okay. Example, I check. Uh, I do the inventory or I check the inventory. From 8 a.m. to uh, 12 p.m. Example. Okay. I check the inventory from 8 a.m. to 12 p.m. What do you do at work? Okay. I'm going to give you uh, two minutes so you can write your answers. Tell me uh, in the morning and in the afternoon, what do you do? Okay, very good. Jocelyn, I take calls from 8 a.m. to 1 p.m. Very good, very good, Jocelyn. Ada, I revise the patients from 7 a.m. to 9 a.m. Uh, ¿Quieres decir reviso? La palabra sería check. Ada, I check the patients. Okay. Uh, Sabrina, I make a lot of documents from 8 a.m. to 11 a.m. Okay. Very good, very good. Uh, puedes también usar, Sabrina, write. I write a lot of documents or type. Si estás usando la computadora, right? I type okay. Okay. a lot of documents. Uh, William, I type reports from 9 a.m. to 11 p.m. No, a.m. <laughs> a.m. to a.m., right? Okay, William, very good. Se te fue ahí, was it the PM? Okay, Evelyn, I check the presentations. Quiere decir presentaciones? Elvin, I check the presentations. ¿Sí? Presentismo. Mm, presentismo. Mm, no sé qué yeah. es. Uh, y, y, y check uh, all the people Stay in the work. Mm. Si están haciendo el trabajo. No, in the company, uh, the presidents, uh, when I check all the people stay in, in, in company, this is the name we mm, use. Okay. Ah, es como to tomar asistencia. Yeah. This ah. is correct. Okay, you can say check attendance. Okay. Right, como yo hago aquí, right? Que I check attendance. Yeah. Okay. All right, very good, very good. Uh, Jose Antonio, I supervise the projects from 7 a.m. to 4 p.m. Very good, very good. Miguel, in the morning from 8 a.m. to 10 a.m., I update the customer database. Okay, excellent job. Very good, very good. William, um, oh no, sorry. <laughs> I send emails from 7 a.m. to 8 a.m. Carla, very good. Deborah, I answer complaints of clients from 9 a.m. to 12. Okay, very good. 
Claudia, I checked the emails from 8 a.m. to 1 p.m. After that, I sent emails from 1 p.m. to 6 p.m. Very good, very good. Uh, Robert, I make reports of production from 8 a.m. to 10 a.m. Very good, very good. Okay, and then uh, William, in the afternoon, I check attendance. Good. René, in the morning, I revise. Que en vez de revise, eh, yo sé la palabra que quieren traducir es revisar, pero hay una palabra mejor en inglés, check, check. I check uh, documents from 9, 9 a.m. to 12 p.m. Very good. Saúl, I check emails from 6 a.m. to 9 a.m. Very good, excellent, excellent. Uh, Ada, in the afternoon from 1 p.m. to 3 p.m., I I check my consult, the consultorio, yeah, and make reports. Okay, excellent, good job, good job, guys. Okay, Carla, I check reports. I, I check report the telephone. Mm, no sé si quieres decir, eh, reviso por teléfono, sí. Carla, quieres decir, yo reviso por teléfono, sí. Okay, I don't know, I don't, you maybe have to check the report that. The telephone. Ah, I checked the telephone report. Telephone report. Okay. Okay, thank you. Very good, very good. Okay, let's go back here to the thing. Uh, let's go back to this presentation here. Okay, uh, just, I want to clear something up with you, right? Sometimes you have, for example, I checked the, Financial, financial documents, okay? Now, if you see here, algunos han dicho document financial, ¿sí? Eh, ¿Qué sería en español? Documentos financieros, ¿sí? So, la orden es, es así en español, ¿sí? Pero en el inglés, ¿qué ponemos primero? Ponemos el calificativo primero, ¿sí? So, this is an adjective, okay? And documents is a noun. Eso es lo que estoy describiendo, ¿sí? Noun. So in English, we put the adjective first. Primero pongo financial y después digo document. Okay. Uh, for example, right? Telephone report. Okay. Sería incorrecto decir en inglés, report telephone. ¿Sí? In English, I have to put first the description and then the thing that I am describing. See, ¿sí? so primero está el calificativo, el descriptivo, y después está lo que yo estoy describiendo. See, ¿sí? okay. For example, what if I say uh, orders medical? That is incorrect, right? What is the correct way to say it? I check medical orders. Okay, very good. Questions? All right. Okay, let's go now to uh, this section. Remember that yesterday we saw the vocabulary, okay? Uh, lo vamos a usar ahora también, okay? Uh, let's repeat after me, okay? Answer calls. Answer calls. Answer calls. Ah, okay, but before we do that, Le voy a agregar el frequency adverb. Always. Remember? Yeah. Always. Um, usually. Usually. Never. Ese sería de último. Uh, sometimes. Sometimes. Rarely. Raramente. Okay. Uh, ¿Qué más? Okay, usemos never now. See, hay varios, see? All right. Now, le voy a agregar un uh, frequency adverb antes. For example, repeat after me, okay? I always answer calls. I always, I always answer, calls. answer calls. Okay, very good. I usually send reports. I usually, I usually send reports. ¿Qué más le pueden agregar ahí? Solamente la expresión de tiempo, ¿sí? I usually check reports in the morning. Okay. I sometimes set up meetings. 
I rarely create web pages. I rarely create web pages. Okay. I always do the marketing. I always do the I marketing. always do the marketing. Okay. I always purchase new products. I always I always purchase, purchase new products. products. Okay. I sometimes check emails. I sometimes, I sometimes check email. I never meet with my boss. <laughs> I never I meet, never with, meet with my boss. Sería raro, ¿verdad? Nunca, nunca reunirse con el jefe. Okay. I sometimes do the payroll. And sometimes I sometimes do the payroll. Do the payroll. Okay. I usually supervise employees. I usually supervise, I usually supervise employees. employees. I always sell products. I always, I always sell products. products. I usually make contracts. I usually, I make, usually contracts. make contracts. Okay. Now, let's just repeat after me. No way you said a frequency adverb, so the way you said. Deliver the products. Deliver the products. Deliver the products. Deliver the products. Hire Deliver. people. Hire people. Hire people. Hire people. Hire people. Check the project. Check the project. The project. Clean the office. Clean the office. Clean the office. Make coffee. Make, Make coffee. coffee. Make coffee. Fix computer problems. Fix computer problems. Problem. Schedule appointments. Schedule appointments. Assist customers. Assist customers. Assist customers. Create new products. Create new, new, products. new products. Check the quality of products. Check, Check the quality. quality of products. Visit clients. Visit clients. Check the inventory. Check the inventory. inventory. All right. Okay, questions? Okay. No. Very good. So, a eso, a, a, la forma que lo usamos, le puedo agregar una expresión de tiempo. ¿sí? For example, I, uh, I usually check the products. ¿okay? Y le puedo agregar una expresión de tiempo. ¿sí? Uh, sorry. For example, ¿ya vieron qué? ¿Qué le puedo agregar? Okay. In the morning. In the morning. In the afternoon, lo voy a hacer más grande. Quiero hacerlo un poquito más grande. Okay. For example, in the morning, in the afternoon, in the evening. Okay. In January, in December, in the summer, in 1970, si me estoy refiriendo un año, right? In 1970, in the 1990s. In the 70s, in the 20th century, in the past, in the future, in 15 years time, in the Christmas holiday, in two hours. Okay? ¿Qué tienen en, perdón, ¿qué tienen en común todas esas? ¿Tienen algo en común? Obviamente in, ¿verdad? Estoy usando in. Pero, ¿por qué uso in? ¿Por qué uso en? Porque es, es algo en general. Yes, very good. General. Okay. Correct. General. For example, if I say in the morning, bueno, la mañana puede tener seis horas. ¿sí? In the morning. In the afternoon, the afternoon can be a couple of hours, right? But it's general. Okay. For example, in 1970. Si yo quiero decir que yo nací en ese año. I was born in 1970. Okay. ¿Por qué uso in? Porque la, eh, ese año tiene 365 días. ¿eh? Entonces, estoy diciendo que simplemente en el año. Puede ser cualquiera de esos días. Okay. All right. Now, let's look at on. The use of on. On Monday. 
on January 3rd, uh, a specific date. On the 10th, el 10 del mes, ¿sí? me estoy refiriendo al 10 del mes, on the 10th. On the first day, on the last day, on my birthday, on Christmas Eve, on East, East Day, on holiday, on my wedding day. Okay. At, at. Okay, perdón, on. ¿Por qué uso on ahí? Specific, right? Specific date. A specific time, okay? Very good. For example, you can say, I usually check the emails, uh, no, the inventory. I usually check the inventory on Mondays. Es decir, todos los lunes hago lo mismo, ¿sí? On Mondays. Now, I have to put an S. ¿Vieron que puse una S? On Mondays, okay? Very good. Now, si estoy hablando del futuro, puedo hablar en el futuro también. Okay, puedo usar, I will check the payroll on January, eh, bueno, estamos en este mes, June 15th. Okay, ¿vieron? Puedo hablar también en el futuro. I will check the payroll on June 15th. Okay. Si le digo a alguien, tienes que entregar este documento antes de esta fecha. So, ¿Cómo lo hiciera? ¿Cómo lo dijera? You, you have, have to, have to uh, deliver, no, turn, turn in, this turn in. Uh, before at. Okay. Uh, on, si estoy un día específico, tal vez este día específico lo tienes que entregar on Friday. Okay. You have to turn this document on Friday. Okay? Turn in. Turn in significa entregar. ¿sí? Turn in. Turn in this document. Okay? You have to turn in this document on Friday. Okay? Very good. Now, también puedo cambiar, si ustedes ven aquí hay un verbo auxiliar, ¿sí? Turn, uh, have, sorry, right? So, puedo usar will, would, could. Piche okay. pregunta. Mm -hmm. ¿Sí? Question? Los días siempre van con inicial mayúscula. Sí, si son eh, eh, on, si tú ves on, eh, son eh, días específicos, ¿eh? Entonces, siempre van a ir con mayúsculas. Sí, es decir, la primera, la primera letra, ¿sí? Siempre va a ser mayúscula. Ok. Uh -huh. Ok. Very good. So, I can change this and I can say I will. Sí, aquí puedo decir yo voy para hablar, para hablar de futuro. Yo voy a entregar este documento. All right. I will turn... This document uh, on Friday. In on Friday. Okay. All right. Very good. Now, vamos a at. Okay. At is this for a specific time. Okay. Uh, for example, estamos hablando de rutinas. Okay. I check my emails at 8 a.m. 8 a. At 8 a.m. Okay. Uh, for example, I sell the products at 10 a.m. I check the inventory at 11 a.m. Okay. I go to lunch at 12 p.m. Okay. I make phone calls at 1 p.m. Okay, so I use at, at. Okay, preguntas, questions. Teacher, y si fuera una, eh, una rutina mensual, at okay. more. Uh, si es algo que, que siempre se repite, puedes usar esta frase. All right, for example, I do the payroll every month. I do the payroll every month. 
cada mes. Every month. Ahí lo, le puedo cambiar, ¿verdad? Puedo decir every week, every day, todos los días, todas las semanas, todos los meses. Okay. I do the payroll every month. Okay. You can use every day, también, right? Every day. Um, I answer emails every day. I answer emails every day. Okay. Esa es otra frase también, every day. Okay, questions? In, on, at. Okay. Tal vez ya, ya lo vieron, tal vez solamente un repaso. ¿sí? Okay. Questions? All right, very good. Now, look at the question. We're going to start off uh, today. Let's look at this question that's in the uh, second lesson, unit two. Está en la segunda lección de unit two. Okay, what's, what's an important strategy restaurants could implement to get more clients? What's an important strategy restaurants could implement to get more clients? Okay. ¿Qué podrían hacer los restaurantes ¿sí? para tener más clientes? Uh, so, I have some ideas here. Uh, I want you to share and I want you to give information. Okay? Uh, for example, here, offer free foods. Offer free drinks. Offer discounts. Have good security and parking. Advertise on social media. Diferentes cosas, ¿sí? Estrategias que podemos hacer. Okay. All right. I want you to think about strategies that you can use to have more business, to get more clients. Okay. ¿Qué estrategias podrían usar ustedes? Si tuvieran un negocio, quieren incrementar ese negocio, quieren tener más clientes, ¿qué hicieran? What would you do? Okay. So I, uh, let's go in groups. Let's answer that question. Okay. Um, esa pregunta es, es la segunda lección en la unidad 2. Okay, let's go to groups. Eh, yo sí, y... ¿Ahora me escuchas? Ya. Yeah. Ahí listen well. ¿Me escuchas? Ya. Yeah. ¿Me escuchas? ¿Me escuchas? Ya, yeah, ahí listen. Qué joder, ahí discúlpame, es el mío. <laughs> no problem. Thank you. It's a normal. It's... Ok, bueno, chicos, entonces ya mandaron la foto. Ok, okay. vamos a ver. I'm going to check the picture. Okay. Uh, Roberto, you, you listen? You listen? Yes, yes, very well. Okay, thank you. Uh, what what is an important strategy restaurant could could implement to get more clients? Uh, just hold on. Let me just confirm. If I have a restaurant, yo tuve un restaurante. I, I will provide to the customer a snack for free. Okay. Like, like cookies, name the restaurant. 
Ay, pastry. Para pa o yung Roberto and Elby? Uh, I think uh, offer the product in the internet. Okay. Uh, for, me, for me, it's very, very, very important. Important, and a new company. Uh, uh, I oh, offering new promos. Uh, very, very important because. Uh, the people, uh, uh, the people visit um, uh, share the new promos. It's very, 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 very interesting for for the people because uh, it is uh, more it is easier uh, the product. Okay. Okay, all right. Who's next? Who's next? We already participate. Everybody? Yes, yeah. the three person. Okay, all right, very good. Uh, what are your ideas, Elvin? What do you think we can do to increase more business? Uh, my idea. Um, I, 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 it's very necessary uh, offer mm -hmm. a new product. Uh, I think very important. Uh, you offer, um, I offer, uh, I offer the product in the harvesting. Mm -hmm. Harvesting is okay. Uh, advertising. Advertising. Mm -hmm. uh, it, the people. Look, the the new proof is very necessary. Mm -hmm. I think mm -hmm. um, I offer uh, my new proof in Facebook. Mm -hmm. is very necessary. It's very important right now because all the people check uh, mm -hmm. Facebook, mm -hmm. and you can and your proof uh, uh, see. Um, more people in the internet. Uh, in this time, is very, very, very important. Uh, are racing in the uh, in the Facebook uh, mm -hmm. or in the platform uh, social social media platform social media platform. And let's see. Okay, very good, Jocelyn. What do you think is a good way to get more business? Uh, well, I guess that uh, if I have a restaurant, for example, I will uh, provide to to the clients uh, like free food, like snacks, like cookies, made in the mm -hmm. restaurant, of course. Mm -hmm. uh, maybe at the end when the person uh, wants to pay the check, I will provide like a kind of gift. There are some okay. cookies for you. like. Mm -hmm. Good, good. And Robert, what do you think? Uh, I think that is very important for the product in the internet and uh, put the branch in a strategic place. Okay, very good, very good. Excellent guys, okay, we're gonna go back right now to the session, okay? Okay, thanks. Thanks, Robert and Jocelyn. Thanks, guys. In this time, I think it's very important. Uh, the advert uh, I think uh, in the time. Advertising. Advertising mm -hmm. is very, very important because uh, can you imitate uh, your page, uh, web, website, uh, you can invite another person. It's not necessarily meeting uh, the people. Mm -hmm. I think that. Okay. Good, good. 
Okay. Excellent. Very good. Very good, guys. We're going to go okay. back right now. 10 seconds. Okay. See you, th see you then. Okay, welcome back. All right, very good. I want to show you something that you can use, okay? We're going to use this phrase. How often? ¿Han escuchado esa frase antes? How often? Yes. Yeah? Yes, teacher. Yes. Right? So, for example, we can say, okay, how often do you brush your teeth? Once a day? Twice a week? three times a month, four times a month. Now, I want you to see something. You say, no decimos one time a day. We say once a day. Sí, no, no usamos simplemente el, el número uno, sí, no decimos one. Si no decimos once a day, okay? Si es dos veces, dos veces al día, okay? We say twice a day. Okay. Twice a day. Okay. Three, y ya después de ahí es solo el número normal. Three times a day. Four times a day. Okay. Very good. Now, look at the, the formula. Once a day. So aquí está el periodo de tiempo. ¿sí? Twice a week. Three times a month. Four times a year. Okay. Hay otro periodo de, de tiempo también, okay, que es que termina con ly. Ly significa mente, es decir, diariamente. Right? Cuando decimos en español diariamente, ¿sí? ly. Mm -hmm. okay. For example, we say daily significa diariamente. Weekly, semanalmente. Semanalmente. Monthly, mensualmente. mensualmente. Annually, anualmente. anualmente, right? So, for example, if you say, how often, how often do you go on vacations? How often do you go on vacations? Entonces, pueden usar una de estas, ¿sí? Cualquiera de estas. You can say, annually, anualmente, okay? How often do you go on vacations, ¿sí? Or you can say once a year. Solo en vez de day, le pueden poner año, ¿sí? Once a year. Twice a year. Three times a year. Okay? Another question, right? For example, how often do you check, uh, check the inventory? How often do you check the inventory? Okay. ¿Cómo pueden responder? Ahora, si nunca lo hacen, ¿sí? Pueden usar en negativo, ¿sí? I don't do inventory. Okay. Yo no hago eso, ¿sí? O tal vez si lo hacen, right? So you say, I do inventory, or I check, cualquier verbo que quieran usar, I check inventory, and then I can use any of these, ¿sí? Puedo usar once a day, twice a week, right? Three times a month, o puedo usar diariamente, mensualmente, ¿sí? Okay, so you can use any of these, okay? Now, hay otra forma también de hablar de expresión de tiempo, okay? Every, ¿se acuerdan? Alguien me preguntó al inicio de la clase, Every quiere decir cada, cada día, cada, cada mes, cada semana. Every two days, cada dos días. Every three weeks, cada tres semanas. Every four months, cada cuatro meses. ¿sí? Ok. Or puede ser un periodo de tiempo que ustedes conocen ya. Week, I'm sorry, day, every day, every week, every month. Okay. Very good. 
So, tienen muchas expresiones de tiempo que pueden usarse. ¿eh? Estas también son time expressions. Ok. Question. Questions. All right. So, ¿qué vamos a hacer? Ya les voy a decir. ¿Dónde está el vocabulary? Regresemos al vocabulary. Where is it? ¿Dónde está? Aquí está. Ok. All right. So, yo le voy a preguntar a mis compañeros. ¿sí? Miguel. How often do you answer calls? I answer calls three times a day. Three times a day. Very good. Okay. Excellent. Uh, Carlos Armando. Present. How often do you check emails? I check emails um, once a day. Okay. Very good. Sabrina. Um, How often do you meet with your boss? I meet with my boss daily. Very good. There you go. Excellent. See? Ya ustedes están usando la pregunta how often. El vocabulario de rutina si están usando la expresión de tiempo. ¿Sí? Okay. Now, I can use, puedo combinar. ¿Sí? I can say, for example, I meet with my boss, okay, daily at 8 a.m., ¿sí? ¿Vieron? I, I meet with my boss daily at 8 a.m., okay? Igual pueden combinar, ¿sí? Estoy combinando daily y e at, okay? All right, you guys can, can do that, okay? Very good. So, ¿qué vamos a hacer? Vamos, les voy a poner ese cuadro de how often con las diferentes combinaciones de time expression. So, ustedes le van a preguntar a sus compañeros, ¿sí? How often, right? Do you check the report? How often do you create products? Right? Tienen que responder con el time expressions, ¿ok? Questions? Preguntas? All right, let's do it. No. Okay, le voy a poner ahí el material. Okay, let's go to groups one more time. Let's change groups. The, okay, the teacher sent uh, the information in the WhatsApp. I often, just to just in the chat. Yeah. I'm <clears> hard. <throat> okay. Okay. Eh, no sé si alguien quiere empezar a preguntar o, o, o así vamos uno por uno y diciendo nombres. Uh -huh. Ok. Uh, I'm going to ask you for you, ok, uh, René. Ok. 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 Uh, who of them do you take a, take a power snap? Take a power snap es como una siesta oh ah. I never <laughs> in, the, in the work no, no. Eh, 
Uh, yeah, problem uh, in the world. If you want in your brain, you take a, a power snap that is just for uh, never. 10 minutes. Never, never. I don't know. I don't know. Never. 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 In the uh, house only. Only in the house. Only in the house. Every day. <laughs> you were a home office or you needed to go to the outside or your or your company? <clears throat> I what? What? It's uh, repeat please. No. You were with uh you were with a home office or you going every day you going to outside? Outside. Outside es como a un, vas a un lugar o trabajas Fuera, en un office? dentro. O en, en, la calle, en la calle, en la calle, en el street, de Clay. <laughs> no, en la. Eh, oh, only office. On office. Uh, on office. Uh, on office. Ok, mm. if, if, you, okay. if you want to work in home office, Sometimes you take a power snap in the afternoon. <laughs> After the coffee, you relax for 40 or around to 30 minutes, for example. Mm -hmm. Oh no? Or sometimes you don't have time. No, oh, sometimes, sometimes. <laughs> Sometimes, okay, uh, okay. sweet and sweet. <laughs> okay. And Ada, who often do you take a, take a drink? Oh, take a drink coffee. <laughs> oh, take a drink coffee. I like it coffee. I am a, take a drink coffee. Mm. One, three, three, three times. Three, three cups. Three times <laughs> in the morning, <laughs> afternoon, at night. Yes, yes. <laughs> Sometimes persons take a, a drink of it uh, until four or five times. Oh. Okay. No, okay. in my case, depend depend the break. Depends. Rarely, rarely, rarely. Depends right. the brain. <laughs> <laughs> and Deborah, who often do you drink soda, Coca Cola? Uh, rarely. I, I, I rarely drink Coca Cola. I prefer water. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Natural. Agua de tiempo, ¿cómo se dice? Agua. Water time. Water water. 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 Yes. Yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. I drink. I drink Coca Cola three no three times. Three oh. times because I like it. Three times. Uh, every day. Uh, yes. Yeah, sometimes every day. Uh, oh. You need yeah. to to try to stop. Yes. Because it's bad to the to to the bar, to the bar. For 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 bones, 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 body. bones, 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 Mm. <laughs> it's dangerous, dangerous. Yes. <laughs> but, yeah. Okay. Eh, Saul, no, right? Saul, your name is Saul, no. Jocelyn. Um, Renee, right? No, Renee, yes. <laughs> okay, Renee. 
And then the next question, who often do you eat pupusas? Oh, eh, I eat pupusas every week. Mm -hmm. Every oh. week. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Mm -hmm. uh, sí, every week. <laughs> okay. Uh, and you, Claudia? Do you prefer pupusas de... Revueltas. Uh, oh. I prefer um, no the cheese. The cheese. Mm -hmm. okay. The cheese. Con <laughs> Okay. Um. How often do you make contact? Jose? Yeah, sorry, make, make contact. No, contracts. Make. Contracts. Contracts. Ah, uh, okay. Make contracts. Hey, I, I what is the question? Make... Uh -huh. Sorry, Jose, permítame. What is the correct pronunciation? Is how often or how often? Or can I say both? La T por veces se reduce un poco, how often? How often? Mm -hmm. How often? Okay, es que yo lo decía, how often? Often? Mm, sí, lo he escuchado decirse así también. Okay. Eh, la palabra es often. Okay. La palabra okay. es often. Pero muchas veces, muchas palabras en el inglés ya conversacional se reducen. Muchas, muchas letras. ¿sí? Especialmente la T y la D se reducen en muchas oraciones. Ok, ok. Ok, no, ¿la pregunta otra vez, José, o ya la tiene? Sí, I, I make contracts um, every day. Ok, daily, diariamente, remember? Daily, daily. También, oh, también puede daily. usar daily. Ajá, uh -huh. uh -huh, daily. Uh -huh. Correct. Okay, now okay. Tú, tú puedes preguntar, José. Ya preguntó José. Oh, oh, uh, no. Gisela, oh, how often do you pray with pace? Sorry, how often? <coughs> you create web, web pages. Create web pages. Create web pages. Web pages. I oh. never, mm -hmm. I never create web pages. Good, good. Good, good. Uh, some... I send report daily. Yeah. Okay. Ask. Um, Carlos, how yes. often uh, um, fix computer problems? How often do you? How often do you fix computer problems? I I never fix the fixed computer. Okay. Um, the department IT is responsible of the fixed computer. Okay, very good, very good, excellent. Hello, Rina, how are you? Hello, Rina, are you there? Eh, nos acaba de mencionar Hi, teacher, un perdón que ando todavía en la calle y no he regresado a casa entonces ah, tuve okay. una pequeña emergencia pero voy a estar conectada les digo aquí a ellos que voy a estar un de meque con ellos ok, ok, no hay problema All right. Very good. Gracias, eh, Fernando, how often do you uh, let me see the web page Hold on. how often aquí está how often do you create new products Create new products. Um, I never create new products. Uh, okay. No. How often? How often do you make coffee at work? 
uh, I never make coffee at work. Uh, I am in home office. <laughs> ah, okay, from your home. Okay, how often do you check emails? Uh, I check emails uh, every hour. Okay, very good. Excellent, excellent. Uh, let's see one more, one more. Um, how often do you supervise employees? I supervise employees uh, once a day. Okay. Excellent, good job. All right, Esteban, Belen, you guys go. Uh, Carlos, how, how often do you check the inventory? Carlos, no sé si escuchó. Did you listen? Sorry. Uh, sorry, I check my, I check um, every day the inventory. Very good. Now, le pueden agregar, se acuerda que dije que lo, le pueden agregar tiempo. I check the inventory every day at 8 a.m. Okay. I check the inventory every day at 8 a.m. 8 a.m. 8 a.m. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay, very good. Excellent. Excellent. Okay, one more. One more question, Fernando. Another question for Carlos. Fernando. Para Carlos. Dime. Otra pregunta para Carlos, Fernando. Okay. Uh, how often do you meet with your boss? Um, I meet with my boss um, three times, three times a week. Perfect. A week is uh, only. Excellent. Okay, ¿quién más? ¿Quién más? Eh, Miriam, Carla, José. Eh, Joseph. Miriam. Miriam. Yeah. How often um, do you hire people? I never hire people. Okay. Um, Carla, how often uh, do, do you make contract? I never make contracts. Contracts. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, Jose Saul, how often do you check the quality of products? Um, I never check the product. At quality. Of oh, quality, sería, ¿verdad? I never check the, pro the product. Of the quality. Check the quality of product. I never check the quality of product. Okay. Miriam, how often do you sell products? Mm. I don't know, can I answer mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Twice uh -huh. in the morning. Uh -huh. Twice. Mm -hmm. Twice in mm -hmm. the morning. Yeah. Okay. Sí, solo se cambia la respuesta en la pregunta. O otra. How often do you check the project? Uh, in December or in the afternoon, no. How often do you check the project in the afternoon? <clears throat> How often do you check the products in the afternoon? I sometimes check the products in the afternoon. Okay, perfect, perfect. Okay, let's see. Uh, William, let me see. Let me let me share the, the 
the picture is that. Okay, uh, William, how often do you send reports? I send reports uh, once a day. Very good. Okay, or you can say daily, right? Or daily. Mm -hmm. How often do you uh, check the projects, William? Check the project. Mm -hmm. I check the project um, weekly. Okay. Very good. Excellent. Excellent. ¿Ya preguntaron todos? Yeah. ¿Ya contestaron? Yes. Okay. Yes. Yes, teacher. All right. Very good. We're going to go back now. Let's go to the session. Okay. Okay. Okay, very good. Let's do attendance quickly. Ada Susena. Present teacher. Ana Maria Chacon. Carla Ibiana. Present. Carlos Armando Duarte. Present. Claudia Marisela Solano. Present teacher. Débora Raquel. Débora Present. Raquel Soto. Okay. Present. Okay, thank you. Elvin Martinez. Present. Fatima Lopez. Present. Okay, very good. Fernando Ernesto. Present. Jose Antonio Cubías. Present. Okay. Jose Saúl González. Present. Carla Janet Maya. Present, teacher. Okay. Luis Sumaña. Present. Miguel Ángel Paz. Present. Okay. Miriam Carolina. Okay. Present. Okay. René Alfonso. Present. Uh, Rina Álvarez. Present. Sabrina Latín. Present. Sandra Elise Berosorto. Present. William Alexander. Present. Okay, and uh, Isela Liliana. Present. Karina Beatriz. Karina Beatriz. And Jocelyn Rivas. Present. Okay, very good, guys. Perfect. Okay, microphones. All right. I want to share with you uh, this worksheet here. Let's do this one real quickly. We can use uh, one of the following, right? So le vamos a agregar allí un, um, un frequency adverb, right? This is the calendar of the week and this is the day, the activities, all right? So look, check. He blank plays football on Mondays. What can I use? He always. Mm -hmm. Always. He Right? Always. Right. Okay? Siempre. Always. Number two. He plays tennis on Sunday. Oh. Never. Always. Never. Um, never. 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 Okay. Oh, never. Basketball, tennis, soccer. <laughs> Ahí está. <laughs> All right. Uh -huh. Okay, number three. Oh, pero borré la número uno. Sería always, right? Number one. Always. Number three. He blank plays basketball on Saturday. Two. He's on. Oh. He. I I I usually. Usually. 
usually. Sí, hay okay. varias opciones. Sí, puedes decir normally, Frequently. usually. Okay. This a week. Frequently. Yeah. This a week. Ah, twice a week. Very good. Twice a week. Okay. Okay. Bueno, eso representa un día, sí. So ahí está un día. Okay. Very good. Uh, he blank plays tennis on Tuesdays. He blank plays day? tennis on Tuesday. Once a day. Uh, once a day. Uh, in love with. Podemos usar diferentes Normally. opciones. Normally. Normally. But look, tennis. Solo hay una. Uh -huh. Hardly ever. Yeah. Okay, you can say, okay, rarely, seldom. Once a Tuesday is correct, teacher. Huh? Once a Tuesday, mm -hmm. I can say. Once a, a month. Once a Tuesday in a month. Once a week. Once a week. Mm -hmm. I don't say the day. Mm. Es que no estoy seguro si eso son, representa todo el mes, ¿sí? O no sé si es el, simplemente un día. So no, no, no me voy a meter ahí. All right, but very okay. good. The last one. He plays football on Saturdays. Normally. No, he never. Never. He never, never. plays football. Saturday. Are you not football? Mm -hmm. So we say never. Oh. Never. Okay, very good. Now, let's do another one, another type of exercise we can do. All right. Let's do this one. All right, look, let me explain this one. You have to put it in the correct order. Number one, so aquí están las opciones, ¿sí? Aquí va la respuesta. What is the correct order? What would be the correct order? Often. Uh, often. Often. He often has difficulties understanding him. Difficulty understanding him. She often has difficulty understanding him. Correct. She often has difficulty understanding him. Okay. Number two. You usually have, you usually pay to have in event. Así como está, ¿sí? Okay, uh, number four. She, uh, she always is polite on the phone. Uh, she, she is always. She always. Oh, she, she always or she is always? She always is polite. Always. She always. She always. Mm. And I can say, she... She is polite, always. Mm, look, is, so you can say this, she she's always, always polite. Okay. She's always uh, polite on the phone. She is polite on the phone. Okay. Mm -hmm. She's always polite on the phone. Will be the correct way. Mm -hmm. mm. Number four. She blank worked last year. She? She very rarely was no. She she was. Mm -hmm. she was. Were rarely rarely very. Rarely no very rarely. Very rarely. No 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 no. Be, uh, very rarely. Very rarely. At work. At work last year. year. Mm -hmm. She was very rarely at work last year. Last year. Okay, let's try number five. Unfortunately, blank to fly to Australia. I always or always is it it has expensive. Has it okay. Unfortunately, being always no. Mm -hmm. Ok, se la, se, la voy, se la voy a traducir en español. En español sería, siempre es caro. It 
It's always. Uh, uh, all been, it's always has been. It always has been expensive. Correct. Has been experimental. Okay. Mm -hmm. Very good. Number six. You. You. You never can. Never. Can need. You never mm -hmm. can find him. I can, you never I can, can find, find him, him when, when you need, need him. You need him. When, you need. when you need. Uh huh. Him. When you need him. Uh -huh. You never can find him when you need him. All right. Mm. Excellent, excellent. All right, solo practicando, right? This we is good for you guys. We never had a problem. Let me see, number seven, creo que la última. See, number, oh, no, I have to go. We never. We, ne we never had, had problems with him. Correct. Nunca tengo problemas con We never have had problems. Have had problems. Have had problems. Mm -hmm. Okay, correct. Number eight. Have um, have you have ever ever have you ever been, have you ever, been you ever, in London? Mm -hmm. Have you ever been to London? Ah, forgot two. Have you ever been to London? Mm -hmm. to number London. number nine. We, we travel. We occasionally travel to other countries. We, travel, to other country. we uh, occasionally travel. Occasionally travel to other country. How often? Okay. How often do you have to renew a passport? How often do you have to renew a passport? Okay, very good, excellent guys, good good practice, okay? Let's go to the activity that uh, we're going to do that's in the book, let me explain it. Okay, all right, so this is the activity that we're going to do. Now, uh, we're going to use, lo mismo, look, the same thing that we're using, always, seldom, rarely, yeah, sometimes, hardly, ever and never, okay? For example, always sería something like this, right? 100% of the time, seldom, uh, like maybe, es, es un poquito más raro, see, it's maybe, um, I don't know, no sé, 60% maybe of the time. Rarely, raramente, okay? It's maybe, I don't know, 40% of the time. And sometimes it's like 50-50, right? Hardly ever, I don't know, and, digamos un 10%. And never, never, zero, right? Okay. Very good. So this is what you were going to do, right? I want you to write uh, your activities from, from, from work, okay? For example, algo que siempre hacen en el trabajo, always, okay? Whatever you do, right? For example, right? See, siempre drink coffee. <laughs> I always drink coffee, right? Very good. Okay. All right. I want you to think about different things. Okay. Seldom, raramente, sometimes, hardly ever, never. Okay. All right. I want you to think about different activities. Okay. And I want you to. Fill this out. Primero llenen esto, sí? Y después lo van a compartir en clase, en el grupo, sí? Questions? Questions? Okay. Let's do it. Okay, vamos a crear grupos otra vez. Okay. 
Ok, Claudia um, recibió la invitación para ir al grupo. Uh, Carla, go to your group, please. I only ever... All right, so cada uno tiene que hacer uno, ¿sí? Yeah. Sí, sí, este, eso estamos. Es, es, ahorita empezamos. Vaya, yo puse esta. ¿Alguien? ¿Raramente? No me, no, me refiero a que cada uno tiene que llenar todo el cuadro de ah, okay. sus actividades. Uh -huh. Y después van a compartirlo. Y después van a compartirlo. Ah, bueno. Okay, questions. All right, so lo, lo primero que pueden hacer es llenarlo con su información y después lo, lo vamos a compartir. Okay, done already. Yes, no, está bien. Tómense unos cinco minutos. Lo pueden completar. Purchase new products. I seldom purchase new new products. Okay. Purchase. Purchase new products. Okay. Uh, I I shall I seldom ask where calls. Ok, so cada uno lo está llenando, ¿sí? Right? Ya, yeah. yeah. después, después lo van a compartir. <laughs> Let me check. No, 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 mi no, no, mi mi no, 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 Okay. Continue some time. I always take calls. Um let me check. I always take school. I readily send report. I hardly hardly ever um supervise teammates. Um I some sometimes I take sub calls and I never I never do the the payroll. Okay. Uh, I I always uh, supervisor uh, supervise supervise uh, my trainer. I uh, really. I really uh me? Trainees. Trainees. I really I yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, continue. Yeah. Okay. I I I really I I really I I re rarely I really rare rarely rarely Rarely, I rarely uh, meet meet uh, my, my with my boss uh, early early ever uh, clean clean the office. Uh, Sheldon, I shall um visit clients sometimes. Uh, Check the project. I never 
uh, clean the office. Okay, I always send reports. I rare, rarely, uh, rarely, rarely meet with my boss. I hardly ever uh, purchase new products. I seldom. Uh, I seldom do the not check the inventory. I sometimes. Uh, sometimes. Uh, I don't know. I sometimes make the coffee and I never hire personal. Okay. That. Thank, thank you. Okay. Carla, ¿Quién, ¿no? ¿Quién no ha pasado? Yeah. Carla. Sí. It's your turn. I did it. Really? Yes. Yeah, Miriam. Yes. It's your turn, Miriam. Yes, okay. Always okay. supervisor employers. I really meet why my boss uh, I early ever check the emails. I never drink coffee in the office. Okay, very good. Thank you. Now, le pueden agregar algo extra, for example, lo que hacen, a qué hora lo hacen. For, for example, I I always check uh, email mm -hmm. every day at 7 a.m. Uh -huh. Now, ya como ya usaste always, no tienes que usar eh, uh, every day. Every day. Uh -huh. okay. Now, puedes dejar fuera always y ser más, más específico con every day. Every day at 7. Uh -huh. Okay. I check emails every day at 7. Okay. Uh -huh. Okay. Okay. So, traten de usar eh, el tiempo ¿sí? at in the time to describe the activities. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, Isela, try to use at to describe your activities. At, at it should be for hour, right? No, at, como para decir, um, I check my emails every day at, 9 a.m. And the time. Uh -huh. so, así como lo hicieron, oh. solo agreguenle al final. At. Okay. The complement time. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh, hmm. With at, I don't know if I can say it. I. I, um, let's say calls um, every day. Uh, no sé, I don't know what can add with at. No, at es el tiempo, ¿sí? A las ocho, a las nueve, a las diez. ¿sí? At. Oh, okay. ¿Sí? I thought that, that I can have like a front two, but uh, I, también, también puedes agregar I, front two. Mm -hmm. I always connect to the to the system to take call at mm -hmm. 10 a.m. Okay. Very good, And very good. Try it, try it for the other examples that you have. I always take my my lunch 
three in the afternoon. Okay. Um, I don't know. For, exa for, for, for example, uh, uh, I early ever meet with my boss. Uh, another part, uh, I I meet with my boss uh, three 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 day in the month in the month, for example. Three times. Three, three times. times. Three times in the month. In the month. Okay. Mm -hmm. It's another it's another form. Mm -hmm. Use the 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 advert the time. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Excellent. Very good. All right. We're gonna go back right now. Okay. Thank you. Okay. All right. Very good. Todo pasaron. Okay. Very good. Recuerden que pueden agregar el tiempo. Okay? You can always say, I usually check the emails at eight o'clock. Right? Le pueden agregar ese tiempo at al final como complemento. Okay. All right. Very good. Hold on. I, I want to. Solo me quiero mandar un audio. Okay, hold on. Okay, okay, hold on. Okay, let me see. I think I can do it. All right, so let me share with you. Okay, sorry, que necesita, necesitaba descargar algo. All right, let me do this, this activity with you guys. Okay, look over here. I'm going to play the audio, okay? And you have to listen. Try to fill out as much information as you can, okay? Listos? Me van a escuchar a mí, sí, en el audio. Okay, ready? Hold on. Lo quiero hacer más chiquito. Hold on. Okay, ready? Look, I have here the clock, sí. Tengo un reloj ahí. Eight, nine, ten, perdón. Eh, sí, bueno, prácticamente un reloj. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, and one. Okay. Listen to me and try to remember what I said, okay? I always check my emails at eight o'clock. I never do the inventory at nine. I sometimes check products at 10. I usually always make coffee at 11. I always go to lunch at 12 p.m. I always take a nap at 1 p.m. I sometimes 
go to the Ah, sorry, no se escucha muy bien, right? All right, escucharon la primera, number one, okay. Eight yes, o'clock. Yes, teacher, right? Check your mails. Check your mails. I always check my check emails at eight o'clock. Okay. Uh-huh. Cierren los micrófonos, please. I always check my emails at eight o'clock. What does he do? You always check emails. Your, your emails. At eight, eight o'clock. Okay, very good. I never do the inventory at nine. You never. You never. You never. You never do. does the inventory. Uh -huh. You never do. Do. Uh, yeah, yeah. Never do. You never ah. do. Mm -hmm. You never do inventory nine. at okay. nine. I sometimes check products at ten. You sometimes check. The product. The product. Sometimes Ten. check products at Ten. all day. Take the product at 10. All day. 10. 10. 10. Ah, 10. I usually always make coffee at 11. I usually always make coffee at 11. Okay. Number 12. 12 p.m. I always go to lunch at 12 p.m. I always take a nap. Oh, Number 12, what did he say? You Your way always go, go, to lunch. Lunch. go to lunch. Take a lunch. Mm -hmm. go to lunch. I always go to lunch at 12 p.m. Go to take a lunch. I always go to go lunch to at 12 p.m. I always take a nap at 1 p.m. You always, you always take, take a nap. nap. Uh, yeah. Take a nap. Tomar una siesta. All right. Oh. Excellent. Right? Very good. Now, I want you to go back to your group, and I want you to tell me this. What do you do at each time? Okay? What do you do at each time, at each hour of the day? Of the day? Okay? Very good. Now, si hacen la misma cosa, Cierto tiempo, ¿cómo lo puedo decir? From it. From, right? From 8 a.m. to uh, 10 a.m. Okay? Si quiero decir, escribirlo así, ¿sí? Okay, very good. So I want you to go back and I want you to tell me what do you do, okay? Eh, por lo menos hasta, hasta lunch, ¿sí? Hasta el almuerzo, ¿qué hacen en la mañana? What do you do in the morning? Okay. All right, let's go back to groups. Okay, uh, go to the group, guys. Uh, go to the, the group, please. I always uh, have a meeting at 9 a.m. Okay. Uh, yeah. At 9 a.m., I always create medical vouchers. Vouchers. Every day. Okay. I sometimes meet with my boss at 9 a.m. I always send production report at 9 a.m. Okay. 10. 
I always send emails at 10, 10 a.m. Okay. I seldom send emails at 9 a.m. at 10 a.m. Sorry. I always type code from ah, 9 a.m. to uh, 4 p.m. <laughs> okay. We ever. I usually meet with my boss at 10 a.m. Okay, I rarely eat a fruit, fruit. How do you say fruit, fruit, fruit? Fruit. 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 I rarely eat a fruit at uh, <laughs> 11, <laughs> 11 a.m. Banana? <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> um, In of you. Okay. I usually uh, check my tasks of the day at 7 a.m. I hardly ever type reports at 11 a.m. Okay. Um, I don't know. I always go to eat with some girls at 12. <laughs> yes, my co-worker. I sometimes respond my emails from at uh, 10 a.m. Okay. One more. I never check inventory at 12 a.m. Okay, and uh, 1 p.m. Um, almost always sleep at 1 p.m. <laughs> it's too big. Anything else? I, I got to lunch at uh, hey, 12, 12 p.m. I rarely drink water at work. Oh, yeah. Está enferma. But <laughs> I rarely check email every hour, hours. I really hardly ever visit clients in the month. And sometimes I call my friends to make sure they are okay. <laughs> <laughs> I sometimes take a break at 2 p.m. Te dormís a la una y te puedes descansar a todos. Sí, está bueno eso. Ah, no, no, dije que siempre me daba sueño a la una. Ah, ok. okay. I always drink coffee at 2 p.m. <laughs> Okay. Okay, very good guys. Let me give you a quick presentation. Daily, some of the daily activities. Okay. Solo para refrescar un poquito el simple present. All right, remember simple present, right? You have to put an S on the verb, he, she, or it. Okay. For example, I usually take the bus to work in the morning. She usually takes the bus to work in the morning. He takes the bus to work in the morning, right? Remember to put the S, okay? Uh, frequency adverbs, if you guys want to see them, okay? Always 100%, usually 90%, normally like 80%, okay? 70% uh, often, 50-50 sometimes, occasionally, seldom, rarely, never, okay, never. Okay, very good. Talk about your morning routines, 
right? Eso es lo que hicimos, ¿sí? Talk about your morning routines. I always get up at 7 a.m. I sometimes cook breakfast. Y aquí le puedo agregar el tiempo, ¿sí? I sometimes cook breakfast at... ¿A qué hora cocina? At 7. Seven. Seven. Okay, very good. Good, good, excellent. I take the bus to work. Now, ¿le puedo agregar algo más? Yeah, remember? Every day. Okay. Twice a week. All right. The best de la semana. Twice a week. Okay. Very good. I can add more information, right? Okay. I sometimes drink coffee at work. ¿Qué le puedo agregar? Maybe at 6 a.m. Right? Okay. Very good. Very good. Or no, muy temprano, right? I sometimes drink coffee at work at 10 a.m. Okay. Right? Okay. Excellent. Another one. I normally have a meeting with my boss in the mornings. Okay. What are your morning routines? What do you do at work? Uh, Fernando, what do you do at work? What are your routine? What is your routine in the mornings? Okay, I, I, started, at, I started working at 7 a.m. Okay. Uh, then uh, uh, I, take break, I take breakfast at a.m. Uh, after after that, I I have a meeting meeting daily, okay. every day. Uh, then I I check my my tasks of the day. Okay, very uh, good. Uh, uh, finally, I I do my my tasks my tasks daily. Okay, so. very good, excellent, excellent, good job, Fernando. Ok, let me show you guys uh, the book. No sé si vieron en el libro. Hay un ejercicio de último. All right, look at this exercise here in the book. Uh, let me see. Maybe I can make it a little bigger. Ok. Look at the graph showing how often three branches of a restaurant do promotional activities in a month, during a month. Promotional activities. Actividades para promocionar el negocio, ¿sí? Look at the activities here at the bottom. I have number one, change the menu, rotate ships, new desserts, promotional items, or offer a promotional item. Alguien dijo, ¿se acuerda la pregunta del restaurant? Quisieran para hacer que crezca el restaurante. Eh, algunas personas di Dijeron que uh, van a ofrecer un producto, ¿sí? Una galletitas, soda, free drinks, okay? So you're going to, uh, what you're going to do here, okay, is ask a classmate how often each branch does promotional activities, okay? So for example, if you see here, I have four branches. I have a branch in San Salvador. I have a branch in La Paz. I have a branch in La Unión. And I have a, Usulutan here, okay? This is a restaurant, okay? So I'm going to ask a question. How often does the Usulutan branch does promotional activities? Okay, ahí está la pregunta, ¿sí? How often does the Usulutan branch does promotional activities? Okay. So, esa persona tiene que ir aquí, right? Y ver Usulutan branch. Okay. Very good. Do you see it there? Okay. Ahí está. Right? So, my answer will be, uh, let's see. Promotional activities. 
All right, for example, uh, the Sultan branch does promotional activities um, every four times a month. Okay. The Usulotan branch does promotional activities four times a month. Okay. Ahí está. Okay. Questions? So, for example, uh, I can ask another question here, right? Otra pregunta, look. How often does the San Salvador branch, okay, a change the menu? Menu. How often does the San Salvador branch change the menu? Sí, entonces yo tengo que buscar esa información acá en el chart, okay? Primero tengo que ir a change the menu, sí? ¿Dónde está change the menu? Ah, aquí está, ¿sí? Y me estoy refiriendo a San Salvador Branch. ¿Ok? So, aquí está. 12. ¿Ok? Uh, you, más o menos 12 times a month. ¿Ok? Sí. No sé si esto es un mes. Sí, yo creo que esto es un mes, ¿sí? ¿Ok? Sí. Yeah. Ah, yeah. Sí, es un mes completo. So, so, how often does the San Salvador branch change the menu? Okay. So you can put uh, they, ellos, puedo decir they, they change, change the menu uh, 12 times a month. Lo cambian bastante, sí. <laughs> right. Pero más o menos es así la actividad, ¿sí? So, how often does the La Paz branch make new desserts? Ok. All right, le voy a dar un ratito para que ustedes puedan trabajar. Con esto terminamos, ok. Tenemos uh, six, six minutes, ok. And then uh, we're going to close with this, all right. I'm going to let you work on that. And with that, we're going to finish. Vamos a terminar, OK? Okay, guys, if we get a group, solo cinco minutos no queda. Go to your groups, please. How often? How often? How often does the union rotate ship? La unión. Esta es la perfecta. Shift. Okay, so rotate shifts right there. La unión. The green one. They rotate shift. Six yeah. times a month. Six times a month. Seven. Seven, creo. Seven. Okay. Seven times a month. Six point five. Okay. Very good, very good. How often San Salvador promote promotional items? Promote um, items? Yeah, promotes, 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 promotes items. Promotes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, sí, bastante. Okay. Digamos que sí. Cada quien se podría hacer twice a, a month. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, Salvador promotes items twice a month. 
correct? Mm -hmm. Hmm. I will open the La Union uh, branch. That's new dessert. La Union. La Union, new dessert. Mm -hmm. Six times a month. La Union. Uh -huh. Por ejemplo, de la unión no, no, no creo que cambie el menú cada semana, cada mes, y ni llega gente ahí. Bien, la paz bien. No, en la unión está muy lejos. Nosotros definitivamente no vamos. We never go. Never go. We never go there. Okay, very good. Uh, how often does the San Salvador branch make new desserts? New desserts? Mm -hmm. New desserts, San Salvador. Um... How often does the Salvador branch make new desserts? Who can answer that question? Teacher, es que no podemos ver los colores. Ah, you can yeah. see the colors. Es el problema, no puedo lo ver blanco y negro aquí. Entonces no puedo decirle. Ah, porque... Blanco y negro, tiene nosotros adivinando, estamos ahí. Porque lo imprimió. Ah, ya, ya lo entendí. No tenemos, no tenemos el diagrama color. Ah, I'm sorry, no lo puse ahí. I'm sorry. Entonces suponemos que... Uh, uh, Lo cambia semanal. Weekly, every day. Weekly, every weekly. <laughs> no, no, postres tiene que ser weekly, teacher. Yes. Si no pierden ah, el cliente. Yes. <laughs> aquí aquí yeah. dice se, sí. se una barro cada 15 días. So, yeah. how, do, how do you say it in English? Every. Every seven. Eh, every. No. 15. 15. Okay, very good, guys. Con esa actividad terminamos. Uh, just uh, for you to practice, right? So, practicaron bastante how often today, okay? All right, let's do attendance. Uh, Adana, uh, <laughs> Ada Susana, perdón. Ana Maria. Present. Present. Carla Ivania. Present. Carlos Armando. Present. Claudia Marisela. Present, teacher. Okay. Débora Raquel. Débora Raquel. Present. Ahí está, okay. Elvi Martínez. Present. Fátima López. Present. Fernando Ernesto. Present. Okay, very good. Alguien tiene el micrófono. Alguien tiene el micrófono ahí. Eh, José Antonio. Present. José Saúl. Present. Carla Janet. Carla Janet. Okay, Luis Luis Umaña. Present. Miguel Ángel Paz. Present. Miriam Carolina. Present. Peña Alfonso. Present. Sabrina Álvarez. Present. Sabrina Latín. Present. Sandra Elizabeth. Present. William Alexander. Present. Uh, Isela Liliana. Sí. Isela. Present. Karina Beatriz. Eh, Jocelyn Rivas. Present, present. Hey guys. Okay, very good. ¿Quién se va a quedar today? Uh, Claudia. Santa Marisela. Está acá, ¿no? No creo que. Yes, yeah, I'm here, Claudia. I'm here. Ah, oh, está Claudia, perdón. Okay, ready? All right, guys. 
Thank you very much. Take care. I'll see you tomorrow. Okay. Great. Thank you. Take care. Thank you. Thank you. Tomorrow, Thank you. Thank you Thank Bye. Good night. Hello, Claudia. Hello, teacher. How are you? Very good. Thank you. Good to see you. Um, All right. <laughs> How do you feel in the class? I feel good um, because now I learned some words. <laughs> Vocabulary. I, yes. My problem is because I never study English, only I learn mm -hmm. just for listen to music, watch mm -hmm. movies. Mm -hmm. Uh, my grandma is not good, but I try. <laughs> yeah, that's good. That's good. So you you're adding vocabulary, okay? Yes, Here. I needed to vocabulary. Okay. Can you give me? Can you give me um um one advice? And I gonna I needed to improve my English for my fluency and vocabulary. Sometimes pronunciation. What did you do uh, improve in your fluences? Fluency. Okay. Fluency. Okay, let me share here with you. Look, fluency is a combination of three things. Okay. Uh -huh. So, fluency no es, no es una cosa solamente, sino es una combinación de algunas cosas, right? Okay. Fluency, to have fluency, right? The first thing you need is vocabulary, right? Porque okay. cuando. Cuando, cuando estamos a, a, a aprendiendo, ¿te acuerdas? Tú, lo primero que decía, ¿cómo se dice esto en inglés? ¿Sí? Yeah, es lo primero, ¿verdad? Right? Yeah. yeah, right? And you look for a word, right? Um, how do you say um, microondas in English? Uh, microwave. Ah, okay. Microwave. Right? So you, you look for vocabulary first, right? Y, y así yeah. como, como un niño que está aprendiendo a hablar, entonces él... Busca vocabulario, ¿verdad? Él tiene una palabra primero. Okay. Now, ya cuando tengamos varias palabras, entonces necesitas una estructura, ¿sí? Para poner todas esas palabras en orden, ¿ok? Y aquí viene grammar, ¿sí? Entonces ya tienes vocabulario, pero no vas a poder ponerlo en orden, a no ser que tengas las reglas, ¿sí? Y para eso es la gramática, ¿sí? ¿Ok? Entonces, la gramática es como esos dos. ¿No has visto las carreteras que tienen unos zapitos a los lados? Uh -huh. right? Así, digamos que esta es una carretera. ¿verdad? No sé si has visto. Y acá hay unos zapitos. Aquí. Right? Si tú te sales de allí, el carro va a sonar. ¿sí? Se va a asustar porque... Hay unos zapitos, ¿sí? Entonces, eso es la gramática, ¿sí? Esa, está allí para solamente guiarte dentro de eso, ¿sí? Ok, now, ya tengo vocabulario, ya tengo gra gramática, ahora todavía te falta un elemento, ¿sí? El tercer elemento es lo que yo le llamo thought organization. Thought organization. Ok. Tienes que tener la la práctica de poner esos pensamientos en orden. ¿Ok? Uh -huh. organization. ¿Ok? Eh, no sé, er, viste el cuadro que hicimos, ¿verdad? Esta ahora, que era, era un cuadrito que decía seldom, rarely, always, never, ¿sí? Yes. Ese cuadrito que hicimos, ese es, eh, te ayuda para este tercer elemento, ¿sí? Entonces, la lección te, te dio vocabulario y gramática. ¿Sí? Pero ahora necesito alguna forma como yo pueda pensar en inglés ¿sí? y poder poner esas ideas en orden. ¿Sí? Entonces, cuando yo hicimos ese cuadrito ¿verdad? que estaba ahí en, en el libro, eh, how often do you, right? Y, y hicimos este cuadrito. Hagamos un ejemplo. Si yo te pregunto, ¿Verdad? Te hago una pregunta. Tell me about yourself. ¿Ok? Tell me about yourself. ¿Ok? Tell me about yourself. Now, okay. puedes usar este uh, cuadrito para poner tus ideas en orden. ¿Sí? Ok. Ok. Um, hello, my name is Claudia. I am 20, 29 years old. 
I okay. live with my mother and mm -hmm. I have two brothers older than me. Uh, my mother works at Tortilla Show and my father, I didn't know because he was not responsible for me, but I consider my father is God because I live in God is all powerful in my life. And also now I don't study at the university because all my mother, she has a lot of debits, debits in her life uh -huh. and I needed to help her. And now I consider myself a responsible person because I always sometimes, sometimes I have difficult to stay punctual in the class because I have a, I don't have flexibility schedule. My schedule is, a, is how do you say routine? Is change, no, it's, a, it's the change. For example, um, sometimes I needed to start at site for 8 a.m., 9 a.m. Yeah, you can uh, say this. Uh, My schedule varies. It varies. Oh, thank you. Varies. varies. Okay, my schedule is varies. Now I I work in a call center for account bilingual. I am a floor worker. Sometimes I take calls, sometimes I, I prepare report for emails, I prepare for goals, calibration, um, sometimes check the whiteboard, the photos, and, and sometimes I, I, I help support with the training or just to get some different types of tools okay. about the account. All right. Hold on, all right, very good, excellent. Now, I'm going to help you with this. I'm going to put this information together. De hecho, tú lo estabas haciendo, ¿sí? Primero, you talked about personal information, then you talked okay. about your family, then you talked about work, and you talked about okay. hobbies, okay? So, quiero que vayas así, mira, cuando, cuando yo te hago esa pregunta, tell me about yourself, ¿sí? Quiero que vayas primero acá, Personal information, number one, right? So this is number one. Number two, family. Number three, work. And number four, hobbies, okay? Okay. All right, now, eh, la cosa es, te voy, te voy a dar una, una clave que te va a ayudar. Okay. Okay. Primeramente, first. Uh, next. Also. Besides, Ay, perdón, finally. Ok. Ok. Estas palabras yo le llamo como el clutch. ¿Verdad? Right? Cuando tú Just no sé for si... connect. Ajá, to connect, ¿sí? Entonces tú vas a. Como el clutch, ¿verdad? Tú estás en primera y ahora vas a ir a segunda, después a tercera, ¿verdad? Entonces tú vas a conectar con estas palabras, ¿sí? Ok. Ok, tell me about yourself. Ok. The personally, uh, the first I woke up to 5 a.m. Uh, every day, and the next I take a no, I take but a you, but, no, no, pero usa este cuadro, el cuadro. Oh, it's personal oh. Infor personal okay. information, <laughs> then family, work, and hobby. Okay, okay. Now I'm going to talk about my personal information. The first, um. I had been working for around four years at Focus El Salvador. No, no, pero, pero no empieces con work. Empieza con personal ah, information. Ah, sorry, personal information. My name, my name is Carlos. Can you say about the personal information? For example, um, your name, I'm your a age. great person. My name is Claudia. My favorite color is brown. brown. Okay, okay, la pregunta es, tell me about yourself. So me puedes decir, uh, your name, your age, where you live, oh. where you're from. And then next, uh, family. And the, oh, yes, I got it. I was confused, sorry. Okay, 
Um, personal information, my name is Claudia Maricela Solano. I am 29 years old and I was born in January, January 15, 1991. Um, I'm single. Um, um, I consider myself a creative person, organized as a person, responsible. Okay, and, now go to family. Next. And next, my family, I live with my family. My fa my mother, she works at Turkey shop. And my old brothers, uh, her name is Yuri. She's a cashier. And the next is a my brother is a, uh, how do you say in English? Uh, ah, sorry, is a, uh, oh my God, is a, uh, I meant is a, uh, uh, aduanero. Uh, he works in, um, he works in, a uh, export. <laughs> In, yeah. In, uh, 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 yes, I like customs. 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 Okay. Mm -hmm. He works at customs, and also I work at Focus El Salvador. I have been working around for four years at Focus El Salvador, and finally, my favorite hobby is sleep. Or in my day off, I sleep for all day. <laughs> all right, then. Entonces, este ejercicio, ¿sí? Es para esta tercera parte. Thought organization. Okay? Right? So, for fluency, you need three things. You need vocabulary, you need grammar, and you need thought organization. Okay. Right? Con esas tres cosas, entonces vas a tener fluency. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Mm -hmm. I appreciate your time and your advice for me. Yes, you're welcome. Thank you. You you you're doing really good, right? Uh, uh, you you like to talk. You like to express yourself, and that's very important, right? And um, I think you're doing really good. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. All Thank right. You. Excellent. ¿Cómo vas en la plataforma? Trabajo en la plataforma. Um, on the platform. Just let me check. Give me just for one moment. Uh, probably today I finish the unit one. Okay. Okay. You, yeah, you have to finish unit one. No, you, unit one, you yeah, terminaste. Right? Unit two. Unit two. Section two. Sorry. Section yes. Two. Section two. Okay. Okay. Very good. Mm -hmm. Okay. Perfect, Claudia. All right. Very good. Thank you very much. And I'll see you tomorrow then. Okay. Okay. See you tomorrow, teacher. All right. Bye. Take Bye. care. Wonderful night. Bye. You too.